Greetings and welcome back to Pogus Plays XCOM Long War. Tonight we have Operation Empty Pyre in Argentina, all the way across on the other side of the world from XCOM. Uh, on the left side we have Brisby, Kite and Mallory. Kite and Mallory will be our two snipers for tonight, so we're going to have a very long range mission. On the right side we have Donovan, and I've forgotten the other two. Oh dear. I'll get them again. That's just my favorite entrance. Position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. Backline, Mallory, Kite, Donovan. Frontline, Kurfkin, Kayeta, and Brisby. Now, because we have our two sniper combo, we want some very long sight lines. So we want to generally avoid the buildings. Either we can come out to this side and go down here, where there's uh, relatively few buildings. Or we can scan across all the way over to this side and position ourselves here. Another alternative is that we can get onto the rooftops, but um, that will still require a fair decent amount of moving and maneuvering. I think for this run, we're going to go with the left side. Once we have those two sides in position, they should be able to see most of that lengthy battlefield. I'm on the move. So let's get everyone moving in this direction. Let's get uh, can move to here. We'll get them to here. Let's see if we can get a battle scanner over that edge. Okay, looks clear. In that case, we can move our snipers up. Already there. their long range positions. Uh, oh yes, she's moved twice. Let's get Dumbin Redthorn. Ah, that is not actually a position. Why is it moving to designated coordinates? Okay. Run up close. Okay. I'm going to overwatch. Yeah. Well, that's worrying. We have aliens right along this sight line. Which means if we continue down this way, we're likely going to be hit from the rear. And with two snipers, that's not something we really want. With that in mind, let's put okay. Mallory here. And send her battle scanner again forward. Just make sure we're not running into a trap. Show's clear. All right, that means we can operate these people safely. Good copy. Moving on target. Get them moving over here. De acuerdo. Solid copy, Commander. Open door to our left. Sounds a thing, man. Sounds Mel. There's enough going down around here that I'm not really searching for Mel right now. Is that an open doorway or a closed doorway? Seems closed. Let's get Brizzy moving, moving out. forward some more. Enemies in sight. 
There we have it, three floaters. That wasn't the thin man I was expecting. Let's get our two snipers off ship first. One down. Bit of a harder one. A second. Two down. Snipers, man. Wonderful. And um, let's get Bruce Lee behind here. Donovan can go into Overwatch pretty safely. Let's pull our other scouts back. We don't really need them to disengage them. Another door open. Where did he go? I'm rolling. Pink. We don't see him anywhere. Another pink on this side. We still don't see him. Well, that's worrying. Um. Hmm. Let's get Kayata back on the line. Move her over to the corner. Let's get Kevin over here and then hunker down. Oh, these two still have their weapons. I'm going to watch this. No sound on the left. Oh dear. And but we are just on the other side of this. Still got one floater on the list. Across this car. Still nothing. Fine, let's get K Edna onto the roof. Nothing. Uh. <laughs> this is seeming more and more like a trap. His window is being broken. Let's move Kayada over to here. Look at our Brisby. Uh, can over into this corner. Have watch. Steady drivers. Thin men. Oh, put that laser to work. And they're out of there. They've come around to Brisbane side. So. And I've just noticed that this entire wall of the building is, well, a wall. Oh dear. Other oh, snipers can see them over there. Four percent chance. That's not really something you want to take. Uh, with that, forty-four percent chance. Moving. Let's get Brisby over here. Let's get Kayella over to here. And let's get Duncan over to here. Donovan can keep Roch on this right. side. I've got my eyes on. On like hunker down. Keep their eyes open. Well, actually, no. They'll keep their eyes closed. Hopefully not get shot. So, hoping for... 
It's a sniper duo. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, Kev came up to here again. On the inside. There's nothing. One thin man has moved up onto the roof with Kada. Which was a small chance to hit. This is the problem with uh, two snipers, you can't really hunt. Let's get uh, let's turn it back onto this roof. We'll keep an eye on things up here. Let's do hunt again again. And kite moves to here to keep the sight with both angles. And then keep her back safe. Hmm. Okay, so the thin men are taking the roof. take the roof as well, but they are in very problematic positions. Let's look at the Ankara. Frisbee here. Get Mallory even further back. That should keep our eyes somewhat open. One is a good shot. The other. What's the other one doing? Up, 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 up. Okay, so they place themselves poorly. As far as I can Pretty much wants Kaeda. Kaeda will. Kaeda may have to take this one. Kaeda needs to move first. So we'll move him here and possibly get shot by the thin man. Sorry, Kaeda. Okay. This is what I really like high movement. Kaeda takes out this one. Kevin almost takes out this one. Leaving Brisby to move across to here. Okay. She can take her shot. We have that one down. And go on. We move her uh, to here. She has all the advantages in the world to take this shot. And we have the grenades left as our backup just in case. Now let's see. What do we want to try next? Let's try down this passage mode next. Team on the roofs. Oh god, that's three more thin men. And our floater. Oh, but they haven't seen us. Uh, that means we can set up the next one. Which probably involves getting up onto the roof, actually. I'm on it, come here. Try taking Dolan's nose out. And then further. Some are clear, okay. Run our two snipers up to here. Let's do this. And here. Oh, we have 
of our three thin men down there. We don't really want to risk them activating, so we'll move Kaeda back here. Kirkin can move back to here. And Brisby can move back to here. There's also those who contend with. We're surrounded by not yet activated aliens. And of course, I will play the buddy. Now, let's poke okay. forward. Did activate any there? No? Good. Let's get Mallory here. Let's get Kite. Here. And cut, move cut further up to here. Oh. And then keep watch over that side. So we activate our lovely little group of thin men down the way. Or we don't! Very angry, injured pointer. They're falling back. Oh yes, he is. Um, On the move. Let's try taking the shot from here. Yeah. <laughs> and since those two didn't activate, let's move Kirk in here. I'm going to. Are they going to move towards us? Yes, they are. Okay, first up, Mallory. 54% shot. Let's try it. Dead. Kite. Oh, you can't make a shot. Make a shot for me next turn. And I guess one of them. Well, let's, uh... Okay, this little trio on this wall. Try and keep their fire into the one area. Kind of expected. Typical thing. Oh no. Worried I couldn't see them. Ah, oh, okay. I take a look. Looks like we have the squad site bugs, so let's switch weapons twice and take our shot. Yes. And you can't see the other one. Yes, he can, and it is dead. Nearly dead. It's actually a pretty good aim, but no, we want to keep everyone down, down, down. Suppression is just fine. That isn't. So the top team will have to deal with him. Again, we have a bit of a squad site bug, so let's switch weapons back and forth. And take that shot. Much better. Now we have Thin Man in a very awkward position. But they'll have med kits, and I just realized this acid does not phase them at all. Frisbee's first. Frisbee's last. That frees up Kite so that we can move him across to... Well, to here. Yes, sir. 
Don't mean to come to Overwatch. And the other two can reload. Well, I suspected they may be on the roof, but I didn't think they'd move across. Oh, that's very interesting. Also a little bit awkward for them. Uh, let's see. Yes, yes, I know they all have acid on them. Okay, I can only see one. And he misses one. Target's still up. Dunnerman can make the flank. Let's see what Mallory's chances are. I don't want this one on the roof. Apparently it's there to stay. I oh did. Somehow I managed to have full cover up on the roof top. Ah. How did it manage that? Um, he says, yes. Okay, at a first. She can't make it over to the other edge, obviously. But she can make it across to here. And then take a 29% shot. Um, hmm. Right, let's get this speed some of the way. Good to go. Let's get Silver Hoof all of the way. Let's put Kata in the middle watch. And we'll get Donovan to clean up this little problem over here. didn't actually get through the armor and she'll be fine. Yes, I know the three of them have been afflicted by acid. Thank you. Okay, Kaokin. I turn to fry an alien. Make it calamari-ish. <laughs> I have a hanging too. Kite cannot take his shot. Is unfortunate. Mallory can, but only with a pistol. So we'll put her onto Overwatch. Let's get Brisby forward. Location confirmed. And let's get Donovan moving around the back. Oh yeah. Um, Kite can switch to pistol and also go to Overwatch. Kayada can move to the edge here. Basically, if he runs out that door, he is going to die. That's actually a fairly likely chance to hit. Okay, Donovan. Poor Donovan. Hasn't been able to get anything done today. Let's get him a kill. Or... Works too. Crispy. Ninety six percent, and you missed. Ninety six percent. Oh dear. Okay. Kai, finish it off. Ninety percent. You won't. You won't. Good. Good. Another day, soon. another successful operation. Eleven aliens dead. A few thin men, which have really not been an issue anymore. I'm so happy. And uh, sectoids, floaters. It's been a nice matchup. Excellent work, Commander. I'm impressed you were able to recover so much of the melt substance without any casualties. Okay, so good. Mallory 
was fine after being shot. Uh, it didn't pierce through her armor, so she wasn't wounded. She gets promoted up to sergeant. She can have access to sharpshooter against full cover enemies, lock and load to reload and then take an action, or low profile to make partial cover count as full. Once again, since she'll be at the back line, she won't need low profile. So sharpshooter is definitely the way to go here. Brisby uh, is PFC, PFC, PFC. Donovan. Grenades do extra damage, smoke grenade, or rapid reaction. Uh, rapid reaction is nice, but once again, we're going to go with Zephyr. Nice collection of corpses, a little bit of other stuff. We will be in touch, Commander. Now with 90 credits, I could start working on another satellite. Um, but with our... With our um, council report coming up in four days, uh, I think I'd rather save it and just... Uh, wait until we have all that money together so that we can buy things up in bulk. Until then, let's continue searching for another mission. Breaking news at this hour. Reports from around the globe indicate a shift in the alien phenomena now affecting cities worldwide. Oh no. We're now receiving word of outright attacks. Looks like they've changed their tactics. But why? Why do this? It's a message to the entire world that nothing can stop them. Terror mission. Russia. Novgorod. This is going to be bad. So, as I'm sure you know if you've already played XCOM, terror missions... terrifying. Terrible. Terrific if you win. Sort of. Uh, if you win, you still lose. You still... Your country not only panics, but it also spreads through the continent. Um, if we lose, if we have to withdraw, if everyone dies, then we lose Russia immediately. The aliens construct a base there, and they'll have taken over that entire country until we can rescue them. We don't want that to happen, obviously. But this is XCOM Long War. We might not have a choice. The aliens will be tough. It's going to be chrysalids. It's going to be zombies. There's going to be a whole lot of floaters, which normally not a problem. But this, every turn they just take another shot at a civilian, ping them out. Not sure about what else could be there, honestly. Uh, this late in the year, we just might see some robotic enemies and I'm just praying that we do not. So let's send out our Sky Ranger. Let's see what units we can ha ha have. Almost everyone is faked. This is a terror mission. We have to take them anyway. Seventeen... Okay, 17 uh, in our roster, 17 injured, and a whole lot of them are going to be injured after this one. I can see why they require us to have so many people. <sighs> Alright, let's clear up this list. 
By taking Mallory. By taking Shayla. By taking Petrusi. By taking... By taking Zhang. We might not have time to heal up. We're not taking Melody. Although... She does have Paramedic. So she could be healing as we move. So we're taking Melanie. And we're taking Vivian Ward. That's five members that are going to be injured. For this, we're going to need it. Uh, we have one, two, three, and four backline, five backline, and only Viv Mord as a scout. And honestly, in this mission, I'm thinking that's about right. Give Zang a laser rifle. We give Melanie a laser rifle. We give Shayla a laser rifle. We give Vivmore a laser carbine and a sword off shotgun. Everyone who can gets a sword off shotgun. I'm just praying I won't have to show you why. <sighs> I'm not sure if we even have enough scopes for everyone. Scope. Scope. Laser sight. Kits. Uh, instead, we're going to give her we're going to give her an AP grenade. A little bit of AOE. Run can keep his flashbang. Okay, has everyone tooled up? Now. I don't want to take this after having run two missions previously. I want to be fresh. I want to be, I want to be ready. So, please join me next time for our first terror mission. This will not be our last terror mission. If we fail this, we are continuing on. We are going until the very end. I hope that that will be a long time yet. This has been Pogus playing XCOM Long War. Good luck with all your efforts, and I hope you join me next time.